Hello. Hi. So we just got out of watching Jurassic, Jurassic World, World the Fallen, Fallen Kingdom. Kingdom. Wait, it's that or Fallen Kingdom? I think it's Fallen Kingdom. Fallen Kingdom. Ladies and gentlemen, people on the stage, it's Fallen, Fallen Kingdom. Kingdom. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, uh, I was going to say something beforehand. Oh, spoiler free. We're not going to give any spoilers. Maybe just meant, quickly mention things of the movie, but no spoilers. So you go first. Okay. All right. Wait, I'm going to pause this because I have to put on the microphone. I, I hope the microphone is not getting crushed or anything. Okay, so I'm going to start off by saying, I'm going to start off by saying that the movie is very intense. Right off the bat, it's very intense. And you're going to laugh, you're going to cry, you're going to get so many feels. I loved it. Um, what are, not the cons, because come on, who am I to judge? Uh, but the humor at times seems a little forced. And although it was funny, it does seem a little forced. Other than that, the CG is amazing. Oh my god! I don't know. If, I don't know if this goes as a spoiler, but there are so many dinosaurs. It's world. People know it's got to be dinosaurs. No, but it's so many dinosaurs. Lots, lots of uh, dinosaurs. This is. I never. I never seen more dinosaurs and in any movie besides Dinosaur, <laughs> and that's because it was focused on dinosaur. But this is so good. There's so much dinosaurs. I loved it. Um, let's see. What else can I say? Well, I'm, I'm kind of biased because I love Bryce Dallas Howard and I'm a big fan of Chris Pratt, so. But anyway, uh, let's see. The characters were, you know, you know them. You saw the last movie. There's no need to explain. There's no need to go into more backstory. So you're going to like the movie. And anyway, so speaking of the, the storyline, the storyline, how can I say it? It's, it's nothing new because it's not, but it is, it is told in a very exciting way. It's a story that we know uh, throughout the years, but it's told in a very exciting way. And oh my God, so much dinosaurs. I'm gonna give this movie an eight out of 10 just because of the forced humor and the, the knowable storyline, but I love it. I mean, 10, 10 would watch again, but that's why I'm giving it an eight. And it's not uh, being judged or anything, it's just that, well, it's a movie that you know, and you and I loved it. I loved it. My favorite part. I'm gonna I'm gonna bump it up to a nine just because there were so much dinosaurs. Oh god, the CG is amazing. And yes, I cried. I'm gonna pass this over to Ryan so he can go over and get his criteria. Yeah. yeah. Shut up. Okay. So first thing first, my three criteria: badassery, it. sass, and feels. What? I can hold it. Okay. Badassery, sass, and feels. Badassery. Yes. Chris Pratt as Owen Grady. Yes, Owen Grady. Oh my god. First off, Chris Pratt is dreamy as all shit. And he's a badass in here as well. Also from the other characters, from what's her name, Claire, and from these two characters. This, kind of, this, this one kind of spoiled because I'm just telling you characters that appear in the movie. Zaya and Franklin. I love them. They were Zia, quite Zia. Zaya, Zia and Franklin. They were quite badass. And it was very intense. I loved it. I love these characters so much. Feels. Yes, I cried over fake dinosaurs. I cried over fake dinosaurs. Can you believe it? I cried. No spoilers, no spoilers, but I cried over fake dinosaurs, and it was not, it was not fun. I loved it, but it was not fun to cry over fake dinosaurs. Badass, oh, I, for, I missed the sass, how did I forget the sass? Yes, Chris Pat is a sassy little bitch, and I love it so much. Also, yes, more sass as well from Claire, they're the main characters in this, sort of in this story. Focus more on them. There is, funny enough, there is no mention of the kids, <laughs> or, the, or the sister, or anything. So, it's a, it's a brand new, it's, a, yeah. it's the same it's story in a new way. Yeah, it's focusing more on them. A lot more on them and yes very sassy also as well these other characters Zia and Franklin which I like I like them a lot and yes that actually feels it feels all that now let me go a bit more in depth uh, the story again no spoilers no spoilers whatsoever it's not some I don't know once you like once something happened you like knew what was gonna happen like oh I've seen this before I know what's gonna happen now but just because of the fact that it's done in a new way with new characters new creations and new forms it's a different experience, and it's still fun and enjoyable. See, let me talk about characters. There are some characters that you love with all your heart. Other characters that you will despise. I just, oh god, no, Hunty. Very bad characters. Very bad people. And let's talk about the visuals. Queen, visual, visual. Dinosaurs. The dinosaur looks amazing. Every single fucking dinosaur. The ones we knew, the ones we didn't know, the new ones, the old ones. Oh my god, the dinosaurs look amazing, and it is. It was an amazing experience. I love dinosaurs so much. And even, and also the animatronic dinosaurs looked amazing. It was just dinosaurs. Sorry, but, you know, if, if you're watching this, you know these are professional. <laughs> but anyways, what else can I say about this movie? It was fun. It was entertaining. Uh, dinosaurs. Always fun. Lots, and it's very intense. Lots of action. It's a very action-oriented Jurassic movie. And 
Hmm. I think that's it. I can say my final rating will be a nine out of ten because this is the only spoiler we'll give at all. So if you don't wanna send, want to want to want to want to see any spoiler, just click away right now. N- want nine because of forced heterosexual romance that does not add anything to the plot. But anyways, I feel that's it for now. Ooh, hunty. I'm there so I am. Oh, that's, God. That's it for this overview. I think maybe the next one will probably be either Deadpool or The Incredibles. Yeah, one of those two. Or maybe Ant-Man and the Wasp, but we don't go watch Ooh. anything between that. We're probably going to go to the Midnight the Release. The thing is, we have to go find a theater that w- is showing The Incredibles in... In English. We and don't do I don't Spanish. know if Deadpool is still here. Mm. Well, anyways, that's it for this video. We'll see y'all in the next one. Bye! Bye.